Hello everybody, it is your girl Bria Van Kooten and I'm back with a new video. As you guys can read by the title, I'm here with another try on haul. Another one, it's another one, another one. Another one, another one, another one. So yeah, I've bought, obviously I've bought, I've been shopping, I... I'll be shopping guys. I'm a shopaholic. I always say that I'm self-proclaimed, self-confirmed shopaholic and I have been shopping. So I'm going to show you guys some things that I got, some things I've been buying, some things I've been purchasing. And of course, as usual, I will link everything in the description box so you guys can shop and all of that. So yeah, if you guys want to see what I got, see how it looks here, see sizes, all that. So yeah, let's get into the video. Hello everybody, it's your girl Bria Van Kooten and I am back with a new video. Alright, so first things first, we're going to get into is beauty. We're going to get into beauty products numero uno. So, of course, your girl made a trip to Sephora. Nothing new. Sephora. <laughs> and I bought a couple of things. So yeah, the first thing that I bought, first thing I see is some setting spray. The Urban Decay setting spray, which is everything 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 this is my first time owning like the full size i always buy like the skinnier smaller like not really sample size but the smaller version that be in like the section when you write get right before the register but i was like you know what i keep buying these small bottles let me just get the full size bottle so i purchased this one and this is my favorite setting spray it is so bomb it's so fire and it works on my skin so 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 well so yes then your girl one day it was the day i was going to the ariana grande concert i was doing my makeup on my lunch break at work to go to the concert and then i forgot my eyebrow pencil going crazy panicking and i had to run to sephora across the street to my from my job and buy a new eyebrow pencil i've never used anastasia's eyebrow pencil ever in my life like literally since i started doing my makeup i have been using elf the elf brand eyebrow pencil i've never used any other eyebrow pencil and that i've been stuck in my comfort zone using that so i bought this one one of my managers she did my eyebrows and it came out bomb i haven't used it on my own because i've been doing my makeup i still was using my elf one but I like how it came out when my manager did it, so I liked it. And yeah, so Anastasia Beverly Hills, that was the story. Forgot my eyebrow pencil, had to go buy a new one. And then next, I got the full size of the Laneige um, lip sleeping lip balm thing. Is the sleeping mask for your lip. So I got the full size of it. Um, you guys saw in a previous video that I had the like mini one, and. I loved how it worked so I got the full size one because the sample one was fire so I actually bought <laughs> the full size one so yeah and then last but not least your girl got a fragrance I got the Gucci Beauty fragrance I've been wanting a new fragrance for a while I've been putting putting it off put it on hold but finally I decided to take the plunge and I bought the Gucci Guilty one. I love the packaging. I love the gold detail and I love the GG. This is Gucci Guilty right here. The only thing I don't like, obviously, you see like my fingerprints. So it gets a little dirty because of the fingerprints. So that's the only thing that I don't like. But the packaging is fire. It's bomb. And it smells so, so, so good. So yeah, that is what I picked up from Sephora. And then next beauty product i picked up myself a new noxima the last time i had noxima was probably what year was that i think it was 2016 i was going on a trip and i brought this big ass noxima because i thought i was gonna get away with it 
I didn't think I wasn't even thinking about like sizing in the airport. I was just like, all right, I'm gonna bring my stuff, and I didn't check them in a the bag, and they threw my Noxima away in the garbage. So three years later, I finally bought a new one. Um, I love how this works on my skin. It worked my skin last time, so we're gonna see how it works on my skin this time. But I just love how it makes my so my skin feel like it feels like it's really cleaning. You feel the cleaning working and happening you feel the tingling in your skin so we're gonna see what it's gonna do for my skin this time but this is bomb i picked this up from ricky's and last but not least in the beauty section i bought myself a vanity planet ultimate skin spa the Obviously, I'm sure you guys have seen this all over Instagram if you have Instagram, but I picked myself up one. I got the purple one. It's so pretty. I love the purple. So yeah, I got this one. Um, I bought this probably like a month ago and I still haven't used it. I need to get some batteries. <laughs> I'm so annoying. Like I literally just have it sitting here, um, but I got a good price on it. I'm Reezy. I follow I'm Reezy on Instagram and she had like a coupon code and I got like... Uh, it was like, I can't remember, it was like 70% off, 80% off. I know, I probably, I think I paid $40 or $50 for this. So I got a really, really, really good price on this. Yeah, this is originally $129 plus tax. So I paid $40 plus tax. I think it came up to like almost $50. So yeah, from $130 to $50. I had to, I had to, I had to, I had to. So yeah, that is it for beauty products. Now let's get into some clothing and shoes. So the first thing, since we was doing beauty first, let's get into some like intimates or whatever. And then into Victoria's Secret. I made a stop to Victoria's Secret and I bought a lot. Like I literally bought a lot of underwear. Yeah, yeah, I bought some cute stuff. But this is not everything because I have been wearing some of the stuff. If you guys know, I went on a trip. I went to the Cayman Islands. So this was since I went on my trip. I bought this stuff. So I did take some of the panties and stuff to the Cayman Islands. If you guys did not see my Cayman Islands vlog, go and check that out. I'll link it in the cards. Go watch that. It was a bomb ass trip. I had so, so much fun. So I have been wearing some of the underwear. So this is not everything. But so far... What I have left in the bag is this green one, and this purple cute thing, this like peach one, this white one, and then I have this orange bra, which I haven't worn yet, which is real soft and real cute or whatever. So yeah, that is what I have so far left in the bag. But like I said, I got more stuff. It's just already put away in my drawer because I've done laundry and all of that. That was just the stuff that... I still have it worn and I just still had it in the bag and I never packed it away and I didn't wash it or anything yet so I gotta wash it and all that make sure you wash the underwear and wash especially the bras before you wear them and put it in your drawer because you don't want no infections or nothing happening so I still have to do laundry and wash those before I put it away so yeah make sure you do that ladies especially when you're shopping in store because people try that on it's on the floor all of that wash it before you wear it and put it in you put it away in your intimates yeah so yeah moving right along let's get into clothing items we're gonna start with Bershka so the first thing from Bershka I already wore so it's hung up here it is this purple lilac slip skirt super super cute I wore it already I will insert a picture of me wearing it so you guys can see how it looks on but this is so freaking cute I got this skirt, um, like I said, I got it from Bershka. I got paid like $20 for that skirt. It was on sale, so I paid $20. And the next thing I got from Bershka was this vest that I have been wanting for a while. I have been looking at this vest and I've been waiting for it to go on sale because it was originally $60 and I was like, eh, I'm not paying $60 for this. And then it went on sale to $30 and I was like, okay, I could, I could, I could, I could spend that money. I could pay $30 for this. Cause look at like, it was just a simple, it's cute. It's simple. It's a utility vest with this tie dye look. It's real cute, but I wasn't paying $60 for this. So $30 I can manage. <laughs> it's real cute. I haven't worn it yet. Still have it in the bag. Um, I always keep like all my stuff in the bag that I want to haul before I put it away. And then after I haul it and try on and all that, then I put it away into my 
closet and drawers and stuff so yeah this is bomb i'm excited to style this and wear this i have some looks in mind so yeah follow me on instagram at bria van Kooten, so you guys can see when i style it and post the looks so yeah got that from bertha and then next i made a trip to top shop before they closed down if you don't know all the top shops in america have been shut down because they were closing and they had a sale up to 50 percent off everything which the employees didn't care because both of these items they just gave me 50 percent off regardless so the first item that i got i already wore i wore it to the ariana grande concert and it is this denim skirt right here super cute light denim i don't have a light denim skirt i only have a white denim skirt and then a black denim skirt so i wanted like a light denim i love the detailing right here at the bottom the little distressing and then the detailing the little zigzag super cute i love light denim so i think this is so bomb the cut of it is fire and the fit is bomb like it gave me a nice little booty or whatever so I was happy about that and this skirt hold on let me look at my receipt the skirt i ended up paying and i paid 20 dollars for this girl's 40 dollars, and they gave me half off so i ended up paying 20 dollars for the skirt and then the blazer it the blazer that i'm about to show you guys it was 100 and i ended up paying 50 dollars for the blazer which this blazer guys is so fire super fire it is this nice mint green oversized blazer with like zebra print buttons. Super dope, super fire. I love how it fits on me. I love the color. I've been wanting like a piece like this color for a while. So when I saw it, I was like, yes, I need this. And it has pockets, which, you know, you know women we love pockets it's on a dress it's on blazers on pants like we love a good pocket so i was here for this and yeah like i said this blazer was 100 and i paid 50 and then moving right along i just made a trip to zara and zara's having their annual sale so your girl had to stop in because it's a sale and i love zara so i went to zara i got this pair of pants if you don't know me one thing you should know is that I, Bria Van Kooten, love pants. I love pants. Love, love, love pants. I have an obsession with pants. <laughs> like shirts and tops, I'm a t-shirt. I could wear a t-shirt. Um, winter time, I love turtlenecks. But pants? <sighs> I don't know. I love pants. Like printed pants, simple pants, wide leg pants, slim pants. I like cropped pants i love pants i love structure i love a good look and i saw these babies and i was like oh my god i need these in my life like and it has like the wide leg bottom the color is fire this off-white cream then the gold buttons look at the detail the detail the detail and then the belt oh my god and then it has like the big wide pockets in the back it has the big pockets in the look at the pocket in the front oh my god i love pants and these pants have structure it has look it has a wide leg and then right now i'm obsessed with wide leg pants so these are fire it's like a cool crop wide leg pant bomb these pants guys were originally 120 dollars and i paid 30 dollars for these so when i see stuff like that i'm like yeah first of all the look is fire but then i'm paying a good ass price bomb 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 like and one thing i can say zara sales if you don't know zara sales are everything when you catch zara on their sale you find you find your gems you have the stuff that's like ah eh, i don't want that you have like your gems that you like these are fire so those are one of them so yeah moving right along i did an order with pretty little thing i ordered three things pretty little thing y'all let me tell y'all how bomb their shipping is i ordered these things on thursday and my order came on monday 
mind you it said it was gonna come in like two weeks but it literally came in three days and they're coming from london so any american company y'all can't tell me nothing nothing because if this company coming from london it could come in three days y'all in america can't tell me she's naive so yeah ah your girl got three items so the first thing i got was this low white crop so i went to the rose mansion with my friend savannah and she had on this crop and i was like nah i need this i need it she told me she got it from pretty little thing and of course i went to order it because if i see something that's fire and i know i can style it i have to have it so it's this ribbed like little crop bra thing with a deep v and then it comes like right under your roof oh, it's so bomb i can't wait to wear this i have some looks in mind but yeah this was like and a pretty little thing had a 35 percent off sale going on so even better they always have a sale going on so yeah this came down to the little crop came out to seven dollars and 80 cents so yeah bomb then i got me a bathing suit i got me a new bathing suit this orange color and uh, i love orange like i always say orange looks so bomb on black people so this is the little top it's like a tie top so cute and this is the bottoms It's like a V Brazilian bikini bottom. So cute. And it fits so bomb. Eee! I love this. So fire. I love the color. And it fits so bomb. Like, I was so good at picking out my sizes. Like, because I got a two on top. And then I got a four on the bottom. Because you know your girls get a little thick. <laughs> so, yeah. And then the bikini top was $6.50. And the bikini bottom was $9.75. So, yeah. Pretty little thing. You are fire. You are bomb. You're better. You're better than Fashion Nova. Like, honestly. And I'm not saying that for nothing. I got these pair of pants last year from Fashion Nova. And I've never worn them. And yesterday, I was going through my closet. I was cleaning up my room. And I took them out to try them on again. And the zipper popped. Mind you, I've never worn these pair of pants. I bought them last July and never worn them. And the one time I was about to go take them out to try them on. The tag is still on and everything. And the zipper popped. So, no. This is some items that I got from Steve Madden. You know, it would not be a Bria closet haul without Steve Madden. You know, I was going to say this. I work there. work for the company. So, yeah. <laughs> so, the first things first. I got this bag when I went to the Cayman Islands on my vacay. The little wooden bag or whatever super cute super bomb it goes with a lot of looks and it fits a lot in it like if it's a lot i literally had a bag in a bag because i was rushing one day and i was using another bag and i threw that bag inside of this bag and it fits so it fits a lot so anything any bag that can fit all my shit <laughs> okay dr seuss i am here for it so yeah i got this one right here that one was actually on sale but because i work for the company i was able to find it it's not in stores it's not in my store i got this from las vegas the las vegas location shipped it to my location <laughs> because i really wanted it for my vacation Ooh, we out here rhyming it yet so yeah then i got three pairs of shoes Yes, I got three pairs of shoes. So let's whoop, whoop. <laughs> let's start from the top to the bottom. Shoe number one, I got these pair of sandals, which it might not be everybody's style, everybody cup of tea, but I like these. At first, I was fronting on them. I was like, mm. but literally, after a while, I was like, nah, these are actually bomb. Like they look fire, and it's gonna be. I've worn some fire looks with this pair of sandals so yeah it's definitely a chanel dupe it's these sandals i'm pretty sure you guys have seen these like chunky sandals that a lot of people have been wearing from different brands and stuff but these are definitely like a chanel 
do because I've seen some Chanel ones that look like this that are like pink fire they're super 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 comfortable I got them in my size so it should a size I'm a size 7 like I I've said before I'm a size 7 in American and a 37 European so yeah I got these um these I believe are $59 and they are called Sean so if you guys are looking it up but like I said I'm gonna link everything in the description box but yeah it's called Sean and then the second pair of shoes I got a pair of heels this heel is called peaked I got them in like a leopard multicolor. so yeah these babies Again, I got them in a seven. These are fire. I have not worn these yet, but I have some looks in mind. Definitely with like a wide leg pant because I've been wanting like a new pointed toe heel for a while. Look at these babies. They're like a leopard, but like green with a pink. And then this strap right here, I like. You can wear it to the back, but you can also wear it this way. So it's like a versatile shoe, a two in one pointed toe look these are bomb bomb.com i'm excited to style these and wear these so yeah i got those i love prints and i don't think i have like a lot of leopard so when i saw these i was like okay this is a leopard i can mess with it's like a different leopard it is an exotic leopard <laughs> and last but not least some more prints i got me a pair of boots already this pair of boot is called great again size seven um yeah i'm ready i know this is early for a boot but it's okay fall is coming and not only that you can still wear boots in the summertime guys it just matters on how you style them so yeah i got these bad boys right here these literally just came in into the store last week like these are fresh off Fresh out the factory, fresh out the Steve Madden factory. Just got these in store last week and I saw them and I was like, oh nah, I need these in my life. And I bought them right away. Oh wait, the heels, the leopard heels were $109. Yeah, $109. And yeah, these bad boys are $129. These little dark brown snakeskin babies with the platform and the thick heel. These are so Sick, very 70s 80s vibes oh I love these I cannot wait to wear these cannot wait to style these I definitely want to do these in the summer with like some short shorts and a little crop <sighs> a look a look like I said so 129 obviously I work there so all these see and stuff I got my discount on so it was way cheaper but yeah that's for y'all y'all prices but oh these are so bomb oh my god like Oh, I think I'm gonna wear these this weekend. This weekend to work. Yeah, it's a look. Has the zipper on the side, zip down. But yeah. Okay, so I did make a purchase from Fenty, and if you didn't know, Fenty pop up. There was a pop up in New York City here two weeks ago. And yeah, if you didn't follow me on Instagram, check out my IGTV video. My first IGTV video. I did a whole unboxing for this, so go check that out. So I'm not gonna talk too much about it here because I did the unboxing there. But yeah, I got a made a fancy purchase. So this is like the bag for it. There you go. And then it comes in this box. So you guys could probably already tell. Like I said, I did an unboxing, so I'm not gonna talk too much about it. But I got some shades. This is the case. And then I got these bad boys right here. These fancy shades that I've been wanting since the Oh, my nails kind of match with it this time. Yeah. <laughs> I got these bad boys here. So yeah, these were $420. And then with the tax and all of that, it came up to $300. And ooh, $300. I said $400. $420. And with the tax and all of that, it came up to $457. So yeah. I got these bad boys right here, which I'm super, super excited about. I wanted this since the first launch, so I'm so excited that I have these in my possession. So yeah, like I said, I talked about them in my unboxing on my IGTV, so follow me on Instagram, go watch the full IGTV video of me talking about it and all of that. And again, and then the last thing, I also, did an IGTV video for this. I did an unboxing video for this. So again, follow me on Instagram. Check out my IGTV video because I talked about it more there. But I got these Nike Shocks Como de Garcon collab. 
from Essence. Essence put them on. These are so freaking bomb. I'm so excited to have these in my possession, in my just aura vibe wardrobe. Like, <laughs> these are so bomb. Can't wait to style these. And I paid 330 for these with tax it came up to 343 dollars so yeah again i did a whole unboxing on my um igtv video so go find me on instagram check out my igtv videos and go and watch both of those yeah. that is it for this try on haul guys you know cute short to the point nothing crazy or whatever i hope you guys enjoyed this video and yeah if you did you already know give it a thumbs up comment below that is chat and if this is your first time watching my video your first time seeing my face and you want to see me some more of course hit that subscribe button it'll be greatly appreciated and i will see you guys in my next video like I said, we're going to, we're going to, I'm going to link all of these items in the description box. Once I find them, it'll be in the description box so you guys can shop and buy and all of that. And yeah, like I said, I will see you guys in my next video. So, peace, love.